Tezel and today we will talk about noti Android notification. In Android notification, we will gonna learn that how we can create a heads up notification. So let's get, uh, let get started in our Android Studio. Open your Android Studio. Here I've created already a project and let me just show you that uh, how you can create a heads up notification. Before that, we will create a notification channel. Uh, I'm gonna create a notification channel in uh, in application class, so I'm going to first create a package. Which I'll name is app, and then I'm going to create a class which which will extend uh, application class notification size. Giving a name is our application. So extends application. Now I'm going to override a on create method. And here I'm going to create a channel private void notification notification channel. And here I'm going to create a notification channel. For creating a notification channel, we need to use a notification channel class. I have created a, or I uh, I also created a notific uh, a video on proper video on notification channel which uh, which links i will provide in description so you can check the, uh, check in here okay notification channel notification channel then id we have to provide a id for our constants we will i'm going to create a uh, class which named is utils so here i'm going to create some uh, st uh, st static con constant variables so for with static final string the channel id should be in uh, yeah. channel id channel id okay and then channel name uh, and channel description Channel name, channel description. Here I'm gonna just change some channel description, channel name, and channel ID is the similar. Okay, and we will gonna set here. So first we will need to use little dot channel ID, and then we need to set the channel name which is dot channel name and then here is the most important part uh, you will need to know that uh, the importance of the notification channel when you will install the uh, application in your app uh, in your mobile where, so the notif uh, the notification channel will be created so you must have to decide that how your uh, notification should should be generated okay so it depends on the uh, uh, importance of the notification channel. When you will uh, set the notification channel importance, it will uh, shows the notification according to that. And you can uh, suppose you like you uh, suppose you like to uh, show your notification as high, low priority, high priority, or sometimes you just want to uh, show your notification in urgent priority. So you can set. The importance of the notification channel here i'm going to set the notification channel importance so you need to use notification manager dot importance high as we are creating the heads up notification so when we will need uh, importance is high so okay fine now just click on this press alt enter for surrounding the uh, notification channel because the notification channel is uh, declared in uh, Android uh, 8. So now let's set the description. Description. So utils dot description channel. This is the channel description. You can set the notification channel description as you want. Okay. Now we need to create notification manager format. Get system service. Notification manager dot class. Okay, so create uh, some. Okay, fine. So now we need to create our channel. 
so for creating a channel manager dot create notification channel here is our notification channel is created now so now let me just go to the complete main activity file and I'm here I'm gonna create a button grab it and grab it and then center in parent for getting in center text we are using we are creating a heads up notification so I'm gonna name it as a heads up notification all caps false I'm gonna use a on click event on this so I'm gonna name it as heads up notification and now just press L10 and create heads up notification in main activity to create a mess uh, method in an, uh, this activity file. So now we're going to create a notification in the combat dot reader. Sorry, uh, wrong class notification combat. We need to use notification combat. Eh? Notification combat. Sorry, uh, the notification builder. builder. And new notification builder. This. And now we need to set the channel ID. Utils dot channel ID. Channel ID should be the same if you want to uh, set it in, into the group. So now we are going to create a small icon. And I am going to use the app icon. So that's an icon. Dot set. Content title. Okay, so I'm going to create some new constants here. Public static final see notification titles. Uh, heads up notification. Heads up title. Title, description, and we need a notification ID. So the ID should be an integer. Notification ID. I'm gonna name it as zero zero one. The content should be in description. So heads up. Notification description, notification description. Okay, that's fine. So I'm going to name is utils dot title and dot set content content text which will be utils dot content description. Sorry, notification description. And now we need to set the priority. So the notification combat or priority should be high. Okay, and now we will set the or uh, cancellation. Uh, the by default uh, auto cancellation is uh, always true. So if you want that the notification should not be uh, cancelled or can't be uh, swipeable, so you can set it to false. And currently, I'm setting it as true. And now we need to create a notification manager combat. Okay. Notification manager dot combat dot com. This okay. notification manager combat dot notify. Now we need to use the ID dot notification ID. And now we need to build dot build. We provided it the notification. Okay, fine. This one is done. That is done. Notification channel is done. So let me just run that.
here where the uh, app is run successfully. So when we click on the heads up notification, we will see the heads up notification title, heads up notification description. As you can see that our heads up notification is shown on the uh, top of the app. Okay, thank you for watching. Uh, if you like the video, please do like, share and comment your queries. And don't forget to subscribe.